Okay, Scott, a guy come by the other day and he had found this old Dutch oven, Camp Chef Dutch oven, at a yard sale. It's rusty. Look how bad this thing is. Inside and out, this thing is just a mess. His first question was, can this be salvaged? And Scott, cast iron like everything else, a little TLC, and you're in good shape. What I want to do is I want to put this iron in my Camp Chef smoke vault. I've got this going. I want to get this iron up to about 400 degrees. That's going to be the key in cleaning this old oven up to start with is just get it hot. Okay, Scott, we've had our old cast iron Dutch oven in there for a while. We've had it about an hour at 400 plus degrees. But see how the, our oven is nice and black? She can see that that old scaly stuff in there has started to peel off. The next step, and this is the key with your iron hot, we're gonna take a wire brush on our electric drill and we're gonna start cleaning this oven up. There's the inside. We just have to do the outside. We're gonna cool it, add some Camp Chef conditioner, put it back in the smoke vault, and it'll be done. Let's do the outside now. Okay, just a very few minutes with the drill and our wire brush and look at that lid. Our iron has cooled down a little bit, so we're gonna go into the next step and we're gonna use our Camp Chef conditioner. I just want a very thin layer and I'm gonna do this inside and out. Okay, while we're doing the lid, we're gonna go ahead and put this in the smoke vault. It's running at 400 degrees. Gonna finish the lid. We've already done the inside of this, so as soon as we finish this lid, we're gonna put it back in, let it heat. Now it's been in there for about 45 minutes to 400 degrees. We haven't even looked at it, but I know this is gonna be just the way we want it. So we're gonna pull it out of the smoke vault. And that, remember that old rusty lid we started with? Well, there it is now. Let's pull our oven out. And look at that, that's ready to cook with. This was the rusty one right here. And this is the one that we used as a comparison when we started. There you go, Scott. You now have the tools to do this start to finish and turn any old piece of abused cast iron with a little TLC into that brand new piece of cast iron ready to go to work. You know, I've learned a lot from C-Dub about cast iron and about cooking in general. If you want to learn more about what he does, go to cdubs.com.